I bet you weren't expecting this when I said that I would recreate the first war. <laughs> Hello everyone and welcome back. My name is Koifish and today I am keeping my promises and recreating the first world war in Total War Empire. Except the mod wasn't for Empire, so this is technically Total War Napoleonic. I hope you guys can forgive me. So as you can imagine or maybe see, this mod perfectly recreates the feeling of the terrible first world war and a huge thing back in world war one was keeping your secrets safe from the enemy with spies on either side trying to steal the secrets and the data from each other i can't help to think that they really really would have liked to have something like today's sponsor this video is sponsored by nordvpn are you googling unsavory pictures of kaiser Wilhelm's glorious mustache do you somehow find yourself in china do you want your computer to pretend that it's in brazil Brazil. Then you should get NordVPN, the Swiss army knife of internet browsing security. It protects your data, both at home and when you're out and using public Wi-Fi. It encrypts your data, not just once, but twice, letting you browse the internet without being tracked or watched. It lets you bypass censorship and regional blocking. With an amazing 24-7 customer support and a 30-day money-back guarantee, this is the time to try out NordVPN and experience the internet as it should be free and without people watching you watching weird stuff. NordVPN and I have teamed up to give you the absolute best deal possible. We're giving you one month free with every purchase of a two year plan as well as a surprise gift. So go on over to nordvpn.com slash koifish and use coupon code koifish at the checkout. Thank you NordVPN for sponsoring this video. Very cool. Let's get into it. We can pick from many of the cool nations that partook in the terrible event that was the Great War. I don't know why they call it the Great War. It wasn't that great. Just gonna be real with you. Now, we could play as one of the major factions. For example, Norway. Norway played a huge, huge part in the First World War. They did this. That's kind of impressive. Uh, and this too. Uh, let's not talk about this though. Are these guys still around? Or maybe everyone's favorite shipping. Austria-Hungary. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Nothing bad can happen to this man. I promised that I would play as one of the side nations. One of the smaller, lesser known nations that also partook in the First World War. Today everyone, we are playing as Germany. Look at that emperor. Don't you just wanna squeeze his mustache? So today, we are doing the real Great War hours. Long live the Kaiser and uh, long live his mustache. So let's get off our benches and jump down in the trenches and have some fun in the fields of Verdun. Let's go everyone. Woman, stop talking. Talking. Go back to the factories and make gunpowder. All right, so we play as the coolest boy in the jungle, the German Empire. Before we start, let's take a look. Who really is the Kaiser? Let's get to know him on a personal level. Friedrich Wilhelm II. He's competent? I think that's spelled wrong, which is very incompetent. We have Theobald van Betham Holweg, Hermann Kuhn. Hermann Lisko. We're gonna have to fire him. We cannot have two Hermann. Moritz van Linker. You look like a real, real guy, my dude. Jesus Christ, you're like a pissed off walrus that someone shaved. And the Navyman. Alfred von Tirpitz. We are at war with France. And Russia. And the United Kingdom. Let's get some historical allies. Italy. You're not gonna backstab me, are you? Sorry, I'm spoiling the end of the movie here. Eugene, don't cry anything or I'll come down and smack your pizza out of your hand. Austro-Hungary. God damn, talking about pizza makes me hungry. <laughs> Norway, trade with me. In a few years, I might come and just take you over. Ah, shit, I, I, I'm sorry, I've read the book, okay? I know how it ends. We are making a whole lot of money. We're gonna need that money, because we are at war with pretty much everyone. Danzig or... Ah, we already have Danzig. Hello and welcome to Germany rearming. Schutztruppe. Yeah, yeah. That's a lot of conscripts. Seasons change. But as Fall Out Boy says in the famous song, people don't. So we need to prepare for war. And here we have light howitzers. Look at these lads, huh? We don't have any research. I'm stupid. Women in the workplace? That kind of based. Hugo Schniff. I, I, I can tell you're doing the Schniff Schniff with that nose. Augenblick. Yeah, yeah, Augenblick. Yeah. In one blink of an eye. I speak German, if you didn't know. Hallo, hallo, ich bin Koifisch. Habst du eine, keine pedophile? No, no, wait, that's something else. Shit. Is it time to move into France? Or maybe we just take Belgium and leave it at that. Oh, French is on the border. Oh, I see a Frenchman. Wolfgang Sacker. What is up with these names? You must be kidding me. You are a, <laughs> what are you sucking? 
Hey, it's Hog Rider. Jun, Jun Rainier. <laughs> right, is our economy fucked yet? Just about. I feel like that's a valid reason to go to war. A scuffed economy. Frenchmen, I see this as a direct threat. We're gonna fight you. Ta-da! They have Polish infantry. This is gonna be hard fought. Ah, we can probably manage. We're gonna form up here and give you trenches. I must say, you are looking snazzy as heck with that pickle haube. But for your own safety, you're gonna be commanding from the woods. Alright, my gentlemen, let the battle commence. Fire! Give them a jolly good shot. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ! Look at you and your red pants. <laughs> oh, yeah! Uh. Oh, yo, 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 yo! <laughs> Our general is under attack. Easy. Have him dismount then, good old chap. And you can hide behind these lads. Keep firing, you lazy gits. What are you even pointing at? Fear! <laughs> we got these Frenchmen running. Run out from the Arden forest. Get out of those trenches. He's just standing there with a knife. It seems that the Frenchmen are running. Sort of what they do. Well, I have an idea. It's unconventional, but we are bayonet charging them in the First World War. Out of the trenches, hit them! Is this an actual tactic? Because goddamn, it's working. Ura! Ura! Are these the snipers? Jesus Christ, they're angry. Oh, they're charging us. But we are numerous. We are the Hun. Look at all this dust we're kicking up. Oh, they shot at us. You're bound to hit someone. <laughs> oh, and he landed in his own grave. <laughs> we did it, gentlemen. The French are no more. We killed Jean Rainier. Huzzah! We only lost 200 people. That's no fake. Acceptable casualties, I say. Yeet! Oh my fucking god, that scream. Are you good, man? You just remember I'm right behind of you? About 30 miles behind you in Paris? <laughs> Conscripts. That's what we throw at them. Just a bunch of men with guns. That's an army. That's the definition of an army, koi fish. <laughs> can we hire the Finns? Hire as many Finns as you can. Voi vit to satana. They are experts at this sort of warfare. Golly gooby. It's a boat from England. And it's blockading my port. No. First of all, out with you, you stupid navy men. Oh, oh, thing. oh Jesus. Speed walking competition, 1914. <laughs> oh, fuck off the UK. Great Britain, what are you doing? Re-implementation of the mortar. Why did we even get rid of the mortar? Send the Finns to the front. Wait, no, the Finns should go be going to the other front. Of course. Did someone say cooking with fire? Let's commit some more crimes. Let's get some women in the workplace, huh? Get out of the kitchen, Martha. I'm putting you in a factory. If you as much as dare light a cigarette in front of me, you you're gonna blow up. That's not a threat from me. You're literally covered in explosive material. What the hell? Did you guys know that during World War II, the women would dye their hair with the chemicals that made explosives? Puts a whole other meaning to blonde bomb shell, doesn't it? We are making a whopping 300 money a, a week. Hello, hello. It is oh, Belgian spotted. <laughs> oh, you, you flee. Where? To France? Oh yeah, we are locked machine gun bunkers. They're very slow to move, which is what you can expect from a fucking bunker. Oh, Belgians back to electric boogaloo. We can stop them on the bridge. We're gonna decline the attack and have them siege us instead. Don't you try it. You absolute Dickweed! Right, Belgians, you standing outside of this city won't make people surrender, okay? I know you're offering Belgian fries, but we've trained our people to be better than that. Right, all these troops, we kinda have to put them to use now, right? Oh, you stop, stop, stop! Frenchmen! More French than, than you could shake a stick at! Offensive against Russia started! In winter... Jesus, I don't care. Go, go, go. Ah, they're dying from the cold. Shit, who could have expected this? Even the Finns, that's unrealistic. Wait out a bit and we'll start the attack as soon as it's not as fucking cold anymore. Hey, yeah, maybe we could declare peace with them. Serbia. Come on, Serbians. What if I, I teach you something fun, huh? I teach you Serbian. I taught them Serbian military tradition. <laughs> Hey, uh, the UK, what about you stay out of this? And I'll teach you something you're gonna really love in the future. Peace treaty with the UK! <laughs> that almost fixes our economy. Talk about appeasement. <laughs> oh shit! Jesus Christ! This is terrifying. Maybe if we're clever with our troops. Mm. Alright, you Frenchmen, let's have at it. The trench line that will reach from here to Belgium. Got me tunes, gentlemen. Where are those guns? There they are. Hit them! Oh, any good hits? 
that's a direct hit! Amazing! That's the only guns the Frenchmen have. So we pound them properly. Look at this, sir. We've taken the building, sir. Oh, uh, that's very good, sir. We have a British general. Oh, Jesus Christ, in the cartwheel. Are we being shelled? Oh, we are! Shit! Oh, shit! That was right in front of my face. <laughs> you brave mad lads, get down from the trenches. You don't have to stand here. Are you walking at me with guns? Is this what constitutes as French tactics? Fire! Sir! Sir, our general is under attack! No, wait! Who's the general? That's the general! Get out of there! General, be brave! You're a Prussian! Cavalry charge! Come on, the... Ooh -wee. Wow, imagine fighting on horseback in 1915! Oh, shit! Get up! Ah, Hans! Nine! Hans, to be steine dead! What the fuck you just fell over? Oh, someone's shooting at you. Right, you should move. And the artillery should punish those Frenchmen for having the gall. Haha, <laughs> that's funny. To shoot at me. Are you dark skin? Wow, progressive. Here we see an exercise in futility. But at least we'll keep them distracted. Our men are running. Yeah, I know why they're running. They're being shot. It's quite a normal reaction. Right, well, hip hip cheerio. Enemy generals been slain. Our general though is... Prancing away in the forest of France. Ah, there we go. We have won. Bye bye, Frenchman. No, wrong way. Come back. That's not France. Well, it uh, it seems that we have fixed our economy, if ever so slightly. My friends, the ground have has thawed, and and we are ready to head in to, to Latvia. With us, we have the Finns. So we cannot lose. In we go. Right, Latvia, come here. You know what? Just give me it. Very cool. We have the options. We take Latvia and we gain 46 region wealth. Or we loot it and we get 2,000. Or we liberate it. Latvians, you are free. Uh, you just found out my boy Latvia is trading with Russia. What the fuck? You gonna trade with Russia? You little shitbag. I'll kill Russia. Sergei, you are gay. Give me the land. Loot it. Yeah. To take everything. Russia boat? Russia boat? No! No, Russia boat! No! We're gonna repair the town council. We are taking Lithuania. Thank you. Hello, everyone. And welcome. We are the Germans. Speak German. Sprechen Sie Deutsch, der Lithuanen. Yeah, ja, ich spreche Deutsch. <laughs> ah, of course. Spicy air. That's gonna be completely legal in a few years. Oh my god, I just told the Danes they could deploy women and they gave me money. Let's try it with the Swedes. Women in the workplace. Give me that much. Ah, no, the Swedes will not do it. Oh lordy lord. What is this out the result? I'll take it. Well, we just took Belgium. And we can loot it for 18,000. Very good. And that means the Belgians are gone. Which means we can take... Oh my god. <laughs> you French bastards. You have no chance. You have no fight inside of you. Yeah, the Belgians are pissed. But uh, what are they gonna do, huh? Nothing, because they're Belgians. It's the Belgians. And they're in open revolt. Railgun? Trench gunners? Jesus fucking Christ. Tell you what, lads, we are leaving Brussels and we're never returning. Workers riot in Brandenburg. Could you stop that? We kind of need those buildings for Bundy, you know. It's time. Let's see what they have. Light infantry? Chasseurs? Well, it's not as terrifying as the Belgians and their fucking railway guns. What the hell? Are you gonna beat them with the flamethrower hose? <laughs> Double artillery strike. Bye-bye, in red pants. <laughs> General killed, right? That means we can switch targets. What about the poles? And there it is. Double time it, you lazy flamethrowers. Look at them running, shit. Tango to the side. Well, are running, sir. Yeah, it's okay that you're running. I understand you. Still doesn't take away from the fact that I wanted to shoot with you guys, but oh well, life finds a way. And so does the Prussian military. Run up, flamethrowers. Burn down the forest. No, don't die! I wanna see you flame! Come on, you cowards! Don't you stand there! Alright, engineers! Where the fuck have you found yourself? No, don't do it! Jesus Christ, that's a bit unorthodox. Boom, 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 boom! I'll hit you with the broom! Oh, no! Eat! Jesus Christ, the trees! <laughs> no! And uh, that's a victory! Not that bad when it comes to losses. Uh, we did lose the flamethrowers, which is kind of sad, but we have found a budget option for our army. Snipers cost literally nothing. Recruit snipers. <laughs> Sniper army. <laughs> also, uh, bad news, guys. They want it back. I say take it from my cold, dead hand.
They say I don't understand you. You're speaking some sort of other language. Oh yeah. It's about to go down. They say betrayal hurts the most. Romania has gone to war against me. Romania! Backstabbing little kids. I think it's time we try out some of her new toys on you. Have at G, you bastard. Voy vitu satana. Every one of these looks like my neighbors. And of course, if you've seen the Mannerheim line movie, you know that this is the actual skin color of things. If you don't know what I'm talking about, uh, check out the movie on screen right now. Absolutely legendary. Have at G. Let's see them fly. Have you shot? Oh, now we're shooting. <laughs> right, we're gonna move up the machine guns. That looks awfully, awfully clunky. And we are firing! <laughs> ah yes! That's the sound of industrialization! Flee you Russians! They're charging! The conscripts! Oh god! Finns! Shoot the Russians! Are you just mowing down their own troops? Jesus! Our general is under attack! Yeah, yeah, but our general is a part of the combat he should be expected to take. General! No! I was like, do we have drummers? But no. That's the machine guns. Mop them up. Why are all of you running? How? You wuss! We have to face the real enemy. Russia, get on the phone right now. Peace with Russia. Thank you very much. We have an actual enemy to fight. And that is the Romanians. And the Romanian siege us down. Get your hands off me, you filthy vampire. If we are to focus on the real enemy, the backstabbing Ro Romanians, then we must finish off France for good. That is a lot of troops. But most of them are, are cavalry. Terrifying as it might be to fight men on horseback, uh, I think the horse meat is back on the menu, boys. Say your final goodbye and eat your last baguette. Paris shall fall. There's the bunker. Is this the famous bunker line of the French? Ah, I see. You are making sure that none of your men will flee. <laughs> it is time we fight off this French menace once and for all. Fire! Bye bye! Oh, who are these? Horses. Draw. Oh, he's draw. He's pulling the man along with him. Here we go. The brave Frenchmen are making a charge for it. Oh, Jesus, did he have a pistol? Ah, ah, you hate to see it. Put your hands. You are firing from the window. Oh, you are teleporting through the window. <laughs> Interesting tactic. Un, un cheval le front. And they're certainly not in a rush. Look at you, huh? Polish infantry. That thousand yard stare says more than any words. Ba, 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 da, 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 Olé, le bataillon. You are the bravest man I've ever seen. Sir, our general is under attack. Easy now. You sure it's not just stray bullets? Here we see the French cavalry migrating to the east. We're gonna have the general run in the silliest formation to encourage you to keep fighting. Hup, 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 hup. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. I don't know what you've been told. My niece is 12 years old. When we're done fighting the French, I'm gonna go visit Stonehenge. Russian military songs are the highlight of human culture. It's like a shooting gallery for the Frenchies. Slaps the roof of building. This bad boy could fit so many German soldiers. <laughs> Oh, an obstruction in the barrel. Let me have a look. Uh, I don't ah! Come on, General. You need to respect that building. What if your soldiers are fighting in subpar conditions? Come on, General. Stop. Into the building. Oh, Jesus. Are you just breaking doors? General, are you pleased with your new headquarters? Oh, we're fighting the Senegalese. Out of the trenches, hip hip. If the French won't come for us, we'll come for the French. Give up, you dogs. Oh, I, I think the game crashed. <laughs> Well, considering how well it went, I'm gonna do this. Wow! Goodbye, Frenchies! <laughs> they were not expecting this. Thank you. <laughs> oh, I liberate Brit Brit Breton. Brittany has been liberated. Look at this, huh? the Grand Tour. Tour de France! This is the first Tour de France! I understand now. It all makes sense. Mm -mm -mm. Hello, hello. Tell you what, France, I feel like you've had enough of a beating. France, no more war. Thank you. It feels like Britain should own this place too. You should be the true owners of Francia. Now ain't that a sight for sore eyes. It's almost like I could cry. Now, as a finale, we will crush the treacherous Romanians. You vampire, Radoslav Serbianikov. My name is Gerhard von Scharnhorst and I have 12 tags. <laughs> it's a box. 
Right, you tanks? Is that the fastest you can go? Well, by God, I'm still impressed. Tanks in total war. It's not exactly lightning warfare. Maybe the time it takes for like lightning to actually appear like in a month. Yeah, that's what we mean. Open fire, tanks. Fire. <laughs> no, they're, they're charging our tanks with the horses. Get out of there. Get back in that tank. Fire. What the hell, tanks? They're beating up the tanks. Stop. Would you look at that, huh? Who knew the tanks were so ineffective in the First World War? Why are all of you running? What are you doing? No, it's the Romanian blood magic. How did this happen? Tell you what, a man needs to know when he's beat. Wait, no, the Romanian blood magic is affecting my computer. It crashed. <laughs> But I use German magic, and that always beats the stupid blood magic. We win, fuck you Romania. And with that, my friends, I think that will have to be it. Thank you for watching the real great War Hours video. And thank you, NordVPN, for sponsoring this video. If you like this, leave a like. Consider protecting yourself from spying people as well as Romanian blood magic by using NordVPN. Anyways, guys. I hope you liked the video, if you did, leave a like, consider subscribing, and join the Koi Fish Cool Club. I'll see you guys in the next video, coming very soon by the way, until then, stay German my dudes. Yeah.